Hey guys, Shireen here with round nine of my To Die For Account card challenge. And I have a huge package from Crafty Irina. Hey Irina. I was uploading the video, guys, because there's so many cards here. And I'm just going through them and feeling good about the video. And it wasn't even recording. <laughs> I think I ran out of memory. It only recorded like the first two minutes of the video. So I've already opened the box and I've already seen the cards. And, um... I'm going to go back through it again with you guys. So, again, these cards are from Crafty Irina. And for my To Die For Challenge, I, we are making cards for the Cub Scouts, uh, for my son's Cub Scout Den. And we're going to donate the cards to a local nursing home and hospice if we get enough. So, um, oh, now I get a little battery message. Hopefully I can get through this video. Okay, sorry about that pause. I just had a message on my screen. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and show the cards. You only have to make one card, any style, any size, any design. But Irene made a grip load of cards, and we're going to go through them, okay? And my battery just came up at 20%, so I'm hoping I can make it through the video. All right, so here's one of the first cards, which is super-duper cute. It has this beautiful flower um, on the envelope. And then the card um, says, Hello, friend. The to die for, um, I'm sorry, the die she uses, her flower die here. Really pretty. She has some layered paper in the back, a beautiful button that she threaded with this pretty pink ribbon. And the sentiment says, hello friend. Has a um, punch here, border punch. And then it has a place to leave a message on the inside. And Irina sent two of everything, so I'm not going to open both. So this is the first one. And then she sent me yet another one of those. So I'm going to leave it in the packaging because they're identical. Okay. Which is also a really pretty card. And here's another gorgeous. I really love this one. This one is very chic. Very um, vintage colors with the browns and pinks and creams. Really, really pretty. The die cut is this gorgeous pinwheel flower. Has a brad in the center. She put some here as well. Um, more, more of her buttons. Gorgeous papers, and she distressed everything. It's really cute. And again, the inside is blank, as required, so that the recipients um, or the nursing home, they know the, the ladies and gentlemen, they're better, and they can put a message inside. So, and like I said before, Irene sent, or Irina sent two of those as well. So let me move those out of the way. And then these are so cute, my goodness. Okay, look at these here. I love this die here. It says happy birthday. It is so delicate and dainty. Look at all the um, looping and scrolling and just really, really pretty. And she put it on this um, wood pattern background. And she has some bling on the inside. Layered, paper, layered the papers. And then she has a spellbinders die cut here. Love that. And then on this one, I like the shoe she did to the envelopes. She embossed the corners of her envelopes for this one. So again, um, I have two of those. And then I have it again in another color, which is a beautiful um, patina type wood here with the like bluish green. You can see the brown coming through. Kind of give that old patina on the wood. Again, she used that beautiful dye. Happy birthday. Where did you get this from? I love this, Irina. Gorgeous. And then again, the bling. Layered her papers. And then she used the dye again on the inside. Different color. So gorgeous. And before, as before, she also embossed the corner of the envelope. I think that's such a sweet touch. I really like that. And again, she sent two of those. There's a lot of cards here, guys, so I am going a little bit fast just because the battery is low and it's a lot to get through. I'm going to keep my eyes on a timer this time because the first time it ended on me and I wasn't even aware of it. I love this one here. All right, so this one has um, like a plaid card base. And I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but there's like some cheese cloth, cloth on here. Really pretty. Then she um, embossed and distressed this paper and made this beautiful... Um, die cut of a flower using um gosh well I felt I had a brain freeze and this beautiful charm in the center and the sentiment says thinking of you and the inside is blank 
And then she made, um, and she embossed the entire folder envelope, I'm sorry, on this one. Look how elegant that looks. Really nice touches. And she made another one. Um, same design, but different color. Love, love, love this color. So pretty. Same elements. Just a different tone. And again, she embossed the envelope. Irene, you were busy, girl. This is a lot of cards, and I am so, so appreciative. My goodness. Okay, then we have this one here. It says, just a note. Um, I'm sorry, just a note to brighten your day. And she cut out these four designer papers here. And then she um, rounded out the corners. She has a die, to die, um, a die cut out here for the sentiment. Beautiful ribbon and some buttons um, in the corner. And she threaded that one. And these are dimensional. Really cute. And the inside is um, blank. And Irene, unlike me, you, you remember to label all your cards. I can feel that on the back. I'm notorious for forgetting to do that. And, um, again, I have two of those. Okay. I think that goes with that one, actually. And there's more. <laughs> more, more, more. These are so cute. Look at this one. So shabby chic. Love. This is actually a wood grain with a floral uh, motif on top of it. You can see the butterflies. That beautiful die again with happy birthday. So delicate. I love that and dainty. She has a doily, a paper doily in a corner, layered with a beautiful organza and satin flower with the rhinestone center. Really pretty. And then again, she used the blue, uh, I mean a pink, sorry, um, die. And it could be six, six, but I think it's a spell binders. And she embossed the corner of the envelope. Really gorgeous. And then she made, um, Two of those in yellow. And then she also made, again, two of them in pink. You guys knew I love this, right? So gorgeous. Wow. Okay, so we got two of those. Irina, thank you, girly. Oh, my gosh. You are just too generous. This is so many cards. And, guys, oh, my gosh. I think we probably have, I haven't counted them. So I know there's over 50 cards, possibly over 75. I'm not really sure, but there's a lot. And I just really appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart. All right, so the video ended before I got a chance to look at this. So this is also from Irina. So I'm going to go ahead and open that up. Oh my gosh, girly. <laughs> this is my absolute favorite, one of my absolute favorite paper pads. I love, 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 love romance novel. This is so gorgeous. I love this paper. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. And then she has a card here for me. I believe it's a card. Look, a seed pack. That is so cute. Um, some people strengthen others just by being the kind of person they are. And then it says inspire. Oh, that's a fabric. That's really pretty. So, oh my God, that is so cute. Look at that. Oh, I'm going to make some of these. That is so adorable. Cute. Oh my gosh, she just decorates everything, even the back. How cute is that? And then, let's see what we have inside here. Oh, what a cute card. Check it out. It says, hello. She has this beautiful layered flower. I love that paper. I've seen this paper before, too. And it has a message inside that I'm going to read on my own. Oh, she's just um, saying she hope I like the card. I mean, the cards that she sent, which, of course, I do. They are amazing. And I do appreciate the gift as well. Irene, thank you so much for participating. You have gone above and beyond with all of these cards. Guys, the challenge only required that you make one handmade card using a, a die cut. And Irene has made, oh my gosh, that's probably, ooh, maybe 20 cards. I think I have like 10 designs down there. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I totally appreciate it. I think Amador, I know Amador has made cards and Tammy has made cards, but both of them um, do not want to be in the challenge so tomorrow I'm going to go ahead and um, select the winner 
I don't think other cards are coming in. I'm trying my best not to omit anyone. But I'm going to go ahead and um, announce the winner tomorrow for, from, for all the participants. Again, thank you so much. I am going to have the scouts, once I get permission from all of the parents and the boys finish the cards they're making, we are going to make a video. I'm going to make a video uh, with the boys saying thank you. They're going to show the cards that they made, and then I'll have all the cards that you guys made um, on display as well. And then we're going to um, take these off to the um, nursing home. And if they allow us to take pictures out there, I'll probably uh, put a video up of that as well, if it's allowed. I'm not really sure if it is or not. All right, but thanks for watching, everyone. Have a blessed day. I'll put Irina's information in the description box below. Goodbye, everyone.